Welcome back. The details. President Abdel Fattah Sisi held a meeting on Saturday with Minister of Justice Councillor Omar Marwan. The meeting tackled following up on the ministry's efforts to speed the resolution of cases before courts as part of the country's overall legal system. Details. President Abdel Fattah Sisi issued directives on Saturday to encourage the use of cutting-edge electronic tools in the judicial system in order to improve case processing time. Meeting with Minister of Justice Omar Marwan, President Sisi reviewed efforts to speed the resolution of cases before courts as part of the country's overall legal system improvement. Presidential spokesperson Councillor Ahmed Fahmi said the head of a state was also briefed on the process of improving the performance of the courts nationwide and its impact on accelerating the resolution of delayed cases, adding that a tangible leap has been achieved. The president praised the judge's efforts, indicating his desire to complete the file during the current judicial year to preserve citizens' rights and ensure successful justice. Marwan also tackled efforts to improve the efficiency of court headquarters and buildings nationwide, as well as to increase technological applications by expanding the use of artificial intelligence methods in transforming oral speech into written text during judicial proceedings. President Sisi was also informed on the executive situation for the establishment of the City of Justice in the new administrative capital, which would feature a central complex for courts, a research center, and a variety of other associated service facilities. Prime Minister Dr. Mustafa Midbouli held a meeting on Saturday with Minister of Higher Education Dr. Ayman Ashour and a number of architectural engineering professors in which he discussed the latest suggestions to develop Cairo Ring Road. Madbouli first indicated that the Ministry of Higher Education assigned Cairo and Ain Shams universities via their engineering faculties to put a vision that aims at improving the visual image of the capital's ring road in preparation for the Grand Egyptian Museum inauguration. Ashur said two visions were already presented as he started with Cairo University's plan, which suggests that the ring road could be divided into different sections, palms to be cultivated on both sides, and they would add a beautiful touch to the area and use as a wind breaks in the same time. This vision also includes the construction of tourism activities area beside the pyramids and gym plateau. As for the vision of Ain Shams University, it includes the establishment of a rock wall decorated with pharaonic designs, in addition to solar energy lights and ad screens. Prime Minister Madbouli said the two visions could merge together to come up with the best image for the ring road giving his directives to resume the detailed studies for each suburb in the area.